Am I audible? Yeah, Thank I've you. just seen an ad for you on Twitch. <sighs> yep. I'm going to dock you half a point for that. That's curious. Why is It is there... raining. What are these sort of red torchlight flickers where there isn't actually anything on the ground? But they're on the ground, they're just like... Oh, they're um, like spells that cast light. They're like a spell ah. version of torches. Got I don't it. know why we want a spell version of torches. Um, it's more convenient. And you only had yeah. to go through how many hours of setting up your astral sorcery to get it? Uh, it's <laughs> oh, no, not astral sorcery, it's blood magic. Potato, potato. Wow. Wait, didn't we? Weren't the trees here last time I looked? Ah, uh, yes. Yes, so there now has been a bit of a deforesting. My house has a gang tank rather than a walkway. Yeah, I, I was a bit annoyed by that. What? Well, the, the roof c connection was via the trees. Ah, I see. And it is now via the falling down. Uh, Hold on. Sorry, I have the springy boots. Oh, no, they weren't springy enough. That I'm gonna try and... sounds like a lack of effort to me. Oh, well, I'm going to try and use the slingshot and see if I can slingshot myself across. Uh, however, the landing area is not very big. This might go wrong. Oh, no. It will definitely go wrong if you push me off the wall. <laughs> oh, no, that was too much. I needed a bit less sling there. Hey, I got across. Uh, that's I'm getting still horny horny. Horny again. Yeah, uh -huh. I keep pressing wrong buttons because I've been playing another game. <laughs> I, I, I have such playing well. Valheim on the line where um she what was it, was it was it Thief you were playing? Uh Thief Gold, yes. Yeah, so I was playing Thief Gold, uh, and um she kept pressing X to back up, but in Valheim X is sit down. <laughs> like sitting down in front of wolves. So she often found herself um sitting down in front of the wolf she was trying to hit, uh, to attack. <laughs> All right, it's uh the passive non-violent wolf fighting. Exactly. <laughs> Uh, sure. Oh yeah, so we're going to want more iron clusters. Mm -hmm. So someone probably wants to go find some iron. We do have four ingots of iron in the smeltery. Is hematite iron ore in this regard? Yes. Or, or, or somebody's put here hem to titty. <laughs> oh, the one around here, it's like down, so it's like down here. He says saying here. Um, well... Without. You weren't quite looking in the right direction, hang on. Um, yes, turn around. Ah, hello, I see you, yes. Yeah, down this oh, way. Oh, so it's down there. Yeah. I thought, oh, you are die doing that, and then I remembered you had springy boots. Yeah. And then I remembered so did I. Um, so yes, I guess the, the other thing that we want is... Um, Twilight Forest shenanigans. Uh, we, we, is the Twilight Forest dimension we've, I've been to? Which is the one where I have to eat different food? Uh, between lands. Yeah, I've been to that one, definitely. Yeah. And, and, and it had like... All the monsters... Some of the monsters looked like Tom Paris's children. <laughs> oh, you can't deny it. Mm, I don't remember them looking like that, really. I, just, I thought... That, that, were they lurkers or something? I just yes. remember them looking like Tom Paris and Janeway's lizard babies. It's not the first comparison that's ranked to mine, but I see what you mean. <laughs> right, any objections of moving the apple orchard? Oh yeah, I wanted to build a swimming pool, didn't I? The apple orchard? Ah, uh, no, but maybe I could build it where the apple orchard is now if it's being moved. I suspect it's being moved because there is something else that wants to be near there. Then. Hello. That's a lot of apples. No, no, don't throw them all at me. Take them to the kitchen. We have a chest for them. How do you like them apples? I'll <laughs> 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 we'll give you a quarter of a point for that. Oh, hi, um, Snowy Motorcycle. Snowy Motorcycle. 
Yeah, someone in my chat. Haven't we had a snowy motorcycle before? Is this a repeat viewer? Whoa! They, they come back. Wow. Why? They <laughs> came back for you. Leave your answer in the comments. I think that's everything now. Yeah, looks like it. And I've oh, even made sure there's still a staircase out. Awesome. Not necessarily one you can climb, but... It's the staircase that you made, RCX. Apart from the last, like, five steps. Yes. I just extended the staircase. Sorry, I do not extend it further. <laughs> <laughs> Indeed. I mean, there are some things that probably shouldn't be in the ore's chest, like 56 sticks, or are they in there for fueling the uh, fire yeah. reasons or something? No, they're not there for fueling. <laughs> oh, yeah, I didn't notice. <laughs> I took all the um, all, all the random bits of crap, <laughs> but I didn't notice those. That was one of me loves less successful songs. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's quite funny. Um, I was listening to Bat 2 today, actually. Um, 2 is the best. Not the whole album. Um, it was a random thing that Google Music decided I wanted to listen to, and it, it was not wrong. Indeed. Which, which, shot, which, which song did it pick? Or? Um, I'd do anything for love. Mm. I don't. I. I well, like obviously that's the most meme song. I don't think mm -hmm. it's the anywhere near it, the best. It, it was basically just 80s rock cheese. That was the whole playlist. Because um, it also went to um, Shine on You Crazy Diamond. Also, also good. But also like bit of an obvious pick. And you know, I thought it knew me better than that. Well, as I've mentioned before, my taste in Pink Floyd is unusual. I think I'm their best workers division there. Ah, uh, are you saying that you have various tastes in Pink Floyd, some of them considered unnatural? I'm, uh, I'm not necessarily saying that. Um, okay, this is the oars chest now, by the way. This is the chest here, okay. Yeah. Well, let's put... Uh, I, I will... I will pop it some ore cherry with the, my, the remainder of my ore. Yeah, I should have put some ores in the chest to start with, you know, to like a busker. Am I allowed to look in the telescope or will that do something? Uh, you won't see anything because it's daytime. <laughs> well, you should point out the sun, you might see something brief briefly and then uh, not see anything. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if they implemented that, actually. It could just give, like, a blindness effect for, like, uh, like a minute or something. Is there a, what is the reason that we've built this such a high tower for Astro stuff? Um, because I needed the Starlight Power. And yes. is Starlight Power hot better the higher you go? Yes, yes, you're closer to the stars. Yes, because, you know, <laughs> it, it, it millions of light years, you know, hundreds of light years away, but... Like, the extra few meters makes all the difference. Yeah, but it's through atmosphere, right? Yeah, uh, uh, but it's still, I mean, 100 meters of atmosphere is not really that much. But yes, yeah. they do ob They build, do build observatories on top of some oh, mountains. Yes, they do, yes. Like, you did some good reason. bouncing there, Red. Yeah, I just, I, I, I actually dropped off a bit sooner than I expected, so... Um... <laughs> yeah, I thought you might have done. <laughs> I, I, I saw your name whizzing past. I, I was going to jump off, but I was attempting to jump off with more horizontal velocity than I did. Yeah, see, that. this is why I want to build a swimming pool. I just want this to be the da ah, the diving board. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for, <laughs> for a really cool swimming pool. Bro, so it could be the Astro Sorcery Tower and the diving board. I don't see any <laughs> any issues with the dual purpose here. Oh, well, I think the main issue might be that uh, Final Sight maybe wants to use this space for something else. So if, completely hypothetically, I were to build a swimming pool oh, okay, on, on this side of the wooden block... Uh, I don't have any objections at the moment. At, hey. at the moment. Like, are you going to find some objections after I've built it? You know, there is a, there is a swimming pool over here, you know. It only takes one bounce to get into it. <laughs> are you referring to the lake bike? Yes. <laughs> yeah, but it's not as cool if you can't dive directly into it. Will I bounce off the bottom of the swimming pool and come back up? <laughs> And uh, that, how that, deep that would be pretty cool is. if you do. I'm now imagining Dan's swimming pool being of just size one, so a single square of water <laughs> which would just jump and stop. <laughs> yeah, like a, a circus acrobat. Indeed. I mean, Minecraft water physics is like kind of that silly to the point where, like, you know, players will just carry a bucket of water because if they fall from a like a large height, if they put the bucket of water down just before they hit the ground. Uh, then they don't take, <laughs> they any take damage. full damage. Yeah. 
<laughs> Excellent work. It's amazing. Uh, you can do the same with um, things you can climb as well. Oh, ladders. You can fall all the way down and then grab the ladder at the last second. Yes, but you can put down the ladder at the last second if you have a place to do so. Mm -hmm. There's a thing that you can get in the nether, like a vine, that is particularly convenient in that regard because you can just place it down anywhere. And then it loops its short video for you. <laughs> Honestly, I would like to get a iron sword, I think, and then possibly attempt to go into the... Okay, um, I can make you an thing. iron sword. Uh, if you'd said that about five minutes ago when I asked it, what oh, people's oh. requests were for weapons, yeah. you'd we've, probably well, have one by now. Not enough for iron swords all around. Um. Anyway, this the, the multi-stage process. I get derailed every time. Like I, <laughs> somebody starts a conversation, I've got no idea what I was doing. I need like a Trello. <laughs> in fact, what I need is a Kanban to limit the amount of work in progress. That's exactly <laughs> what I need in this thing. Can you make a Kanban? I'm sure there's a mod that adds like a post-it board or something like that, but. Uh... Mm. I don't think it's in here. Oh, hey, heavenly spirits of P-slams. 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 You tell me. <laughs> no, not Psalms, the A and the L's the wrong way around. Anyway, whichever. Uh, welcome to the stream. Uh, and they ask, do you hate Twilight Forest bosses? Well, to answer that person's question, <laughs> the ice cream. The ice cream? Ice cream. I like ice cream. It's tasty. A great fan of the cream. ice cream is a pain in the ass. By the way, um, am I gonna if ice cream is a pain in the arse, you're eating it wrong. Mm -hmm. Am I correct in assuming I'm not really wanna, gonna want to deal with these bosses on my own? Oh no, no, you're not. Okay, RCX, where are you? Um, I am mining gold at the moment. Okay. Um, why do you have a uh, bow? I do have a bow for you, and I'm sure you will look very pretty with it. Nah. Um, I do not yet have any arrows. Okay. Um, anyway, so yeah, according to the spreadsheet, what we want for our arrows is uh, Naga Scale Shafts, Prismarine Heads, and Raven's Feather Fletching. Do you think we can get those things? Uh, that's um, all Twilight Forest Twilight. stuff. <laughs> well, off you go, Mike. <laughs> Do I want to start or join a video call right here in this spreadsheet? No, it's not <laughs> even my spreadsheet. Why the hell would I want that? <laughs> How, how do I tell? How do I tell what damage arrows actually do? By the way? Um, with vanilla arrows, it actually depends on their velocity. Okay. So it depends. Ah. There is. So there we, is don't a... need, we don't need a Kanban. We need a scrum board. Uh, with um, there is actually a contraption you can build in vanilla uh, Minecraft to kill the Ender Dragon with a single arrow by accelerating the arrow with TNT, like lots and lots of tier TNT that's like Excellent. got synchronized explosions. <laughs> Does, when, when did our, when, when did our do, house lose its other door? Uh, when I got annoyed with dealing with both of them. All right. And now we have a nice window. <laughs> Sorry, what I thought you meant your actual house. It's like... <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> and Mike. Mike, stop running away. I am throwing a sword at you. Hold up. Okay, so what was it you said I was looking for on this in this place? Like, if what? you look on the map, you're looking for a thing that looks like a snake head. Okay, I uh, don't think there is any of those visible. Not the best, the easiest map to read. Can't see. God, um, Mike, it's just all objections, isn't it? I... What's a good thing for me to go and do? Or join in and do? Uh, good question. Uh, any suggestions, guys? I mean, you could help Mike. Yeah. I, I do feel like what he's doing is maybe not a one-person job. Is it a two-person job? Maybe. I'm not going to com commit to an answer on that one. <laughs> See, that's what I thought. Um... <laughs> You could also help me go get some uh, black quartz from the beneath. I suspect Dan is right. This is... It is more than a two-person job. Well, now, which one is the beneath? Is that the one of all my food ones? No. Wait. no. It may be more than a two-person job, but two people is still more better than one person. Ed, you're going to <laughs> Twilight Forest. Two people is more better. Which... Okay, where are the portals to each one? 
They are right next to each other. Yeah, the Twilight Forest one is the one that's a pool that you jump into. Oh, maybe we should put that as the swimming pool that's underneath the giant diving so, board. If you take the purple oh, yes. pill. Um, oh, I see. And then the portal. You take the black. No, no, the, this is the, the teleport, isn't it? I remember. Yes. This one. Yeah. So either is fine, but I'm going to the beneath. Oh, I joined you there. Um, we're looking for uh, black quartz. I'm always a bit worried when somebody comes into the smeltery and then walks out again after having looked in all the chests. I feel like I'm going <laughs> to look in the chest and all of my crafting materials are going to be gone. Uh -huh. That's because you're an intelligent man. It's because there I watch my own go. episodes. Oh shit. Ah, uh, there's a shadow here. I, I, I saw the annoying? shadow of the shadow. I don't know. <laughs> Me to you. Ah, here's the shadow. Being annoying? Nope. Running late. Okay, fine. Whatever. Are you carrying a light? Um, yes, it, well, I have um, a thing that gets me uh, magical torches that I can, like, throw. The red glowy but... things. Have you noticed how, like, I'm in charge of the tools, and I'm <laughs> making tools for anybody who wants tools, whereas the guys who are in charge of the magic have magical lights that nobody else has? Yeah. <laughs> well, the thing is, these magical lights are fueled by our blood. Yes. Ah, magical excuses as well, eh? Mm. Ah, that bloody creepy, uh... yeah. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Yeah. I got thing. I got thing. I guess I'm going back to the beneath to get my stuff. Mm -hmm. Help. I should be okay, thank you, RCX is down there, near to where I died. Oh yes, of course, yes. RCX, do you want to know? I'm getting a little bit ex exploded. Oh! Oh, oh sorry. Yeah. Silverfish, do not, do not want silverfish. Oh god, I forgot about the silverfish in my car. God damn it. I also have a broken sword, so that's not helpful either. Is it um, the blood one? Yes. Um, I have my old one, which is broken, so you might try repair it with it. Yeah, I think the problem is he has to live for that. Well, that's not too much of a problem. Uh, RCX, tell me when you get yes. back to the base. Uh, I am back. Why? Where are you? Um, in the like main crafting area. Why? Uh, have you got a uh, bow for me? Excellent. And uh, some arrows. Cool. They don't stack. Ah uh, yes. One no, stack. No, it's fine. It, one stack is like many. One arrows. stock is not one shot. Yes, I made more arrows than I needed to. Yeah, <laughs> because you didn't realize that. Well, because it said in the book, one stack provides many shots. Yes. But I didn't realize that one stack was one arrow. Mm -hmm. Ah, yes, fair. I thought they were going to like stack to 16 or something, but you would get more than 16 shots mm -hmm. out of them. You have a tied yeah. archery, you, you draw back the bow and you shoot it and you're left holding <laughs> 15 16 of the arrow. Yeah. <laughs> but it's one giant arrow that takes <laughs> up as much space as like 64 blocks of stone. I'll come up and give it to you. Uh, <laughs> I accidentally fell off the roof. Yeah, I noticed. Ooh, thank you. And I even got an arrow for it. Yeah. Is the arrow automatic? Oh, I got it. Yes, the arrow is automatically loaded. So I merely have to have like to me on a Friday night. <laughs> Are you saying that you want to do? You want to do what you want to do? And you want to get loaded, and you want to have a good time. Like Boris um, Johnson, we're going to have a party. A work meeting. Like Boris Johnson, we're going to work meeting like it's 1999. 
I, I'd forgotten how much I liked the um, song "Loaded" by Primal Scream until I until I thought of using it in reference to Boris Johnson. <laughs> That's uh, an oddly specific kink, but fine. Join us again next time while Mike is on his own in the Twilight Forest and Tufty keeps equipping the group with bows and too many arrows. Toodle pip! Do you think that Boris Johnson's next um, next confession about the whole party gate thing will be so I lied, I cheated, I bribed men to cover the drinks of other men, I am an accessory to parties, but most damning thing of all, I think I can live with it. And if I had to do it all over again, I would. That Garak. seems unlikely. Garak was right about one thing. A guilty conscience is a small price to pay for the party. You're reading it, aren't you? I am reading it. I, I was going to be very impressed and then realise you would be reading it. <laughs>